welcome back to another video and we hope you guys got, got a lot accomplished i know it's been a while guys but we will definitely have an update video coming on the channel but if you're new here please don't forget to make sure to like comment subscribe 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 smash that bell to be notified every, every single, single time, time we, post. we do post content like this well we can't even say often, but we're going to go back and say often because we are going to be posting content like this. Exactly. If you're excited, stay tuned. All right, guys, now that you've seen these up close and personal, let us know down below. What do you guys think about them? How do you guys feel about them? Any comments, concerns? Drop them in the comment section down below. Right. Um, you want to go first? No, you go think? first. All right, I'll go first. First of all, I want to say these are super nice. I was just mentioning in the middle of the summer that they should come with an all-black colorway. I mean, they should have did this already this drop before school because I know this would have sold out. But they end up dropping it. Um, Right now, it is actually sitting in store. I'm super shocked to see it. But I know people are going crazy with the all colorful ones. I know this will be a cop for me because I love the all black subtle look. And um, so definitely in that insole really goes really nice. Um, I feel like if he did the insole all over the shoe, it probably would have sold out faster. But I won't be surprised these sell out in store soon. What about you? What you think? I honestly feel like this is the perfect basketball sneaker or back to school sneaker. Like all black, you can't go wrong with it. It wouldn't get dirty fast. You could play on the hard top or inside. I do like the insole being the best uh, feature of the sneaker though. But if you guys pay attention closely, it is reflective on the tongue, on the midsection of the sneaker, and as well here on the toe piece. Um, he did add a little bit of flavor towards that. I like that. But other than that, it's an all black Lamello ball. I feel like we needed that. Even though it's sitting in stores, I don't think it's going to sit for long because it is a sneaker that's very versa versatile and all ages and genders can wear it. Right. And guys, if you can't find your size or can't find um, the shoe in your local stores, you can always hit us up at thegalaempire.com and be able to cop and shop with us and get your pair. All right, guys, hopping right into this on foot look. Now, I do want to mention the hints of chrome on the tongue of the sneaker as well as on the pull tab on the back are super fire. They add lots of flavor to the sneaker as well as that nice spider web all around the back end of the sneaker. Now, going into sizing and comfortability, I would recommend going at least up a full size. I am a 8.5 and these are a 10 and they almost fit. A nine and a half would be perfect for me. So I do recommend going up a size. All right, guys, we're going to go right into resale. So first of all, what shocked us the most, there was no resale. As in, this sneaker is not on stock yet as of yet. Um, I'm, I'm not, it's not new. I mean, the release date was supposed to be today. I don't know what's happened to StockX. But tell us, let us know in the comment section down below, what would be a good price margin to post these shoes yep. for? And let us know what would you pay for. Would you pay way more for these would you pay 150 160 let us know the bids down below right guys if you don't know they did retail for 125 after taxes 133 here in the states let us know if it's different where you are but if you did have ship to me option on the foot sites it ended up becoming i think 143 yeah 143. because to ship but because most of this most of these pairs only released on ship me option but we're able to find these in store. So let us know down below. What do you guys think we should price these at? I think these are this is a, a good shoe. Right. A good shoe to make a good 50 bucks over. I don't know. Let us know in the comment section down below. All right, guys. Before we end this video off, don't forget to comment down below. What do you guys think we should price these for resale at? Do you think they have any resale in them? Comment down below. What is your favorite feature about this Puma Lamello Ball 1 all black? I believe it's called Iridescent. It's still not on StockX. Um, let us know what you guys think. Anything you want to add? Yeah, let, guys, let us know. Puma's coming up in the basketball space. So let us know how you feel about Puma's overall. Let us know your favorite basketball shoe that's coming up, whether it's Kyrie. I know Kyrie's killing the game right now. Yes. Um, Paul George, LeBron, let us know. And let us know if this LaMelo, if LaMelo's are your favorite. Let us know in the comment section down below. Exactly. I think LaMelo's changing the sneaker game, the basketball game. And it's really cool. It's really nice. Hoping a lot of more influencers can come up and do something different with the different brands like Puma and Adidas who are trying to get bigger in, in, in basketball. In basketball right. But guys, if you are new here and you're still watching, please don't forget to make sure to like, comment, subscribe, 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 smash that bell to be notified every, every single, single time, time that we post. Because guys, we're going to be start posting often and you want to always stay tuned to that. Exactly, guys. Follow our social medias at, at Gala Kicks, at Gala, Gala Training, Training, and check out our website, thegalaempire.com. We'll see you in the next one.